y'all, another day, another night, I'm woken up with just, just a hurt heart, a hurt heart, um, I can't imagine someone being proud of having an abortion. I just, I can't imagine. And my brain, my heart, my my whole body, I can't imagine. Especially when they're passing this stuff with the late, late term abortions. I mean, do they understand that as a human being? This baby can feel, I mean, do they inject these, these babies with some kind of numbing or pain or something? Because they're literally ripping their limbs apart. Do you leave the head and the face on for last so you can't hear the baby screaming? Is that what you do? Huh? It's sick. It's sick. It makes me so sick. <laughs> I pray for these innocent babies. I pray for the babies. I pray for the moms that are on the fence. Because, like, you may not know what to do. But I'll be darned if I'm going to waste one prayer. One prayer. For you women that are happy. And are getting up and saying, I'm proud I had an abortion. And I'm not going to waste one prayer on the people that were the Senate people that were up and cheering. Because they got this late term abortion passed. You know why? I'm not going to waste a prayer on you because you're going straight to hell. Okay? I don't mean to be an ugly person, but you're going straight to hell because it's pure evil. Pure evil. Women that are on the fence, you have to understand this is a human being. I could have been aborted. You could have been aborted. And you weren't here. The child that you are thinking about killing could possibly be the person that could come up with the, the cure for cancer. Could possibly be the first person to walk on Mars. Could be... The, the the person to win a gold medal for the United States in the Olympics. I mean, do you understand that? You, and, and you're not just killing that one baby, too. You're killing generations. I mean, I just don't understand the thought process in this. Have you seen the pictures of what they do? I saw a picture. Of, of just a baby's face. It's horrible. It's absolutely horrible. And you're proud of this? I woke up with my heart hurting, y'all. I think this is absolutely ridiculous. Oh, jeez, and I'm not an emotional person, but I'm just... I'm so, I got, I'm, it's mixed emotions. Are you like this? Are you like this? It's mixed emotions. It's the, I'm hurting so hard and I'm just so angry at the same time. Like, I just don't know what to do. It's like, I don't know if I, I want, I just want to, you know, and then I'll just cry. It's ridiculous. But I really, really hope that I don't know we need to have some kind of I don't know Jesus might be coming again because this is ridiculous this is absolutely ridiculous we need to stop this we need to stop it now I don't know what to do but we need to stop the Democrats from literally killing me y'all are so freaking hypocritical y'all are so hypocritical you're worried about the kids on the Mexican border being in in, in cages which they're not you've figuring your imagination and you know what it they might be behind fences it, obama did that okay so get over yourself um it, you're worried about oh what is it a, a caterpillar 
the same woman that wanted to pass the thing in, in what is it in Virginia? Is that worried about a caterpillar? But then you're not worried about a baby? You just, y'all, I cannot wrap my sane mind around these Democrats. I just can't wrap my mind around it. I mean, look, every life is a life. But y'all are so worried about uh, animals more than human beings. You're worried about uh, what is it, some kind of bacteria on Mars or something. You think it's, it's a, a, a living thing, but then you don't think a child with a heartbeat in a womb is a human thing. It's okay to kill. Sorry, my anger's coming out. <laughs> I'm just, like I said, I have such mixed emotions about this. I must look like a freaking wacko, okay? But, I mean, I just, I don't know what to do. Are you like me? It's like, I'm upset and ticked off at the same time. Well, anyway, let's pray for the babies, y'all. Let's, we have to pray for some kind of, I don't know, intervention or miracle or godly thing to come down and I don't know zap these people's brains into sanity because it's getting out of control it's out of control